Adobe Analytics tutorial for beginners in 2021. Hi guys, in this video, I'm gonna be giving you a basic overview of how Adobe Analytics work and how you can get started with it within a couple of seconds. Firstly, I want you to come on to business.adobe.com and then I want you to simply choose Adobe Analytics. Now from over here, what I want you to do is that I want you to simply click on request a demo and then after that, I want you to simply put in the information that they're asking you for like all of these things and then after that simply submit it and they will reach out to you via their service for a demo presentation so when you sign up you will basically have access to all of these benefits you will have web analytics you will have marketing analytics and you will also have attribution analytics as well predictive analysis brings it home because they make things super super easy for anybody who is just starting out with all of these things now over here we can even see some testimonials from different people as well so now what i want you to do is that i want you to click on benefits from the top and then i want you to simply like you know check out the benefits from over here you will have web analytics after two decades of digital innovation web analytics is still at the heart of enterprise decision making but in those two decades a lot has changed they're a leader in the forester wave web analytics because they've been on the forefront of their change using ai machine learning and other advanced technologies you go beyond visits page views and bounce rates to find customer insights that really drive the bottom line on the right side you can basically see channel and marketing analysis can do so much more and then also you have a lot of other options as well basically predictive analysis so predictive analysis basically analyzes your past it sees everything and then after that it basically gives you a prediction of what is going to be happening next in the future so like that is very very nice now coming up you can basically see all of their features up top so i'm going to click on all features now and then I'm going to open up all the features of Adobe Analytics. So over here, you can basically see some other features. On the right side, you have multi-channel data collection. Now, multi-channel data collection basically means that you can organize data in multiple layers of data. So they offer multiple ways to capture data from virtually any source, web, email, campaign, web-based kiosks, mobile devices, client server applications, and most applications that access the internet. So secondly, you can also like, you know, sort data through custom variables. Now guys, sorting data through custom variables is a very hard task and not a lot of people can actually do this. Now, what happens is that this basically attaches a number, attaches a variable to every single piece of data, and then basically recalling them gets very, very easy. And that really makes it very, very efficient because like without custom variables honestly it's gonna get super super difficult for any task to get organized and for anything to be like you know maintained or be accessible later in the long run so like guys that is why this is so so nice and also guys they also provide you with unique processing rules so unique processing rules means that that every single server side operation is going to be processing and populating variables and defining visitor segmentation rules allowing you to create real-time segmentation of all online data without creating complex rules on your side after that you even have the online data integration as well if you want to like you know use that and also offline enterprise data management as well so like all in all this is very very nice and honestly it makes it so so much fun so after that we even have the advanced segmentation over here to ad hoc analytics now all in all, this tool is the only tool that you would honestly need to keep track of all your data, of all your websites, visitors, and everything else. Now, you can get faster insights than everyone, and you can stop manually analyzing rows of data and spending time with descriptive reports. They use artificial intelligence, machine learning, and automation to help data scientists dig in where it really matters and everyone else to get the real-time insights they need. Now, on the right side, we basically have the marketing attribution as well. So like using this, you can have multiple rule-based and algorithmic approaches to attribution of a robust analysis of customer behavior, providing a best fit model per channel based on your channel actual interaction pattern. So like all in all, this makes it super easy. And honestly, I would recommend this anytime of the day. 
then you can even like you know create and manage audience segments based on any behavior and share that audience segment seamlessly to the adobe experience cloud for activation in other experience cloud products now after that you can even track audience analytics advertising analytics remarketing triggers mobile marketing third-party integrations and so much more now over here they even have uh, some uh, more softwares which you can like basically compare this with you have an adobe analytics prime and also adobe analytics ultimate now all these softwares are really really nice and you can see a full comparison of adobe analytics over here now from over here you basically understand everything that you need to know about adobe analytics in general now let's take a look at their comparison section now with their basic section you are going to be getting like you know all of these features but no advanced segmentation, no anomaly detection, no contribution analysis and nothing like that. But with their prime version, you are going to be getting all of these features, but you are going to be getting them in a limited format. But using their ultimate feature, you are going to be getting a lot of these features all while getting all the features in their maximum capacity. Like for example, with their prime version, you will only be getting 15 online data integrations and using their ultimate version, you will be getting 200 offline data integrations. You can integrate data from a CRM system or any other source of online or offline enterprise data for example a loyalty program levels as an added analysis dimension so like definitely very very nice features and honestly not a lot of websites really offer these things so now what i want you to do over here is that i want you to click on that particular button so to basically see what they do better now all the other competitors they simply collect data from a limited number of sources and then sample data so they only show you a portion of the complete data set at any given time but adobe analytics allows you to collect data from a wide range of channels including voice ott audio and the internet of things and they give you access to all of this data all the time every time and then you can basically see that they have static dashboards and reports that are hard to customize, making it difficult and time consuming to analyze data. But Adobe Analytics has a fully interactive dashboard that's built for you, analysts, but accessible to marketers, giving you the ability to create and apply segments, set algorithm based alerts and build powerful visualizations all at the speed of thought. So guys, like definitely it is very, very nice and very, very beneficial as well. So now you guys almost basically understand every single thing that you need to know about this particular software now you even have some resources over here as well let's check out the pricing of adobe analytics really quickly so adobe analytics is basically gonna be like you know not that expensive but like they're not gonna charge you a lot of money so we are simply gonna like open up adobe analytics pricing right now yeah, so basically Adobe Analytics has no free version and they can cost you more than $100,000 a year depending upon how much hits you have. Even when you want to add additional tools, it can cost you up to seven figures. So usually large enterprises use Adobe Analytics for comprehensive customer data integration. So like guys, honestly, it is not for like, you know, new businesses and stuff. It is only for big enterprises because they are really expensive. So guys, this was basically the video. And if this video helped you out, make sure to smash that like button subscribe and till next time goodbye